Okay. I suppose I managed to fix the... I suppose I managed to fix the problem with my microphone and it looks like it's working fine now. So I can continue this game. I'm sorry, I need to, s to stop the streaming. Yeah, Lauren, I think I, I fixed it. I don't know what happened. It's just... Um, I unplugged and plugged it back a few times. And now it looks working. I just lost my microphone from the from from the system, like completely. Thank you, Lauren, and I'm sorry for that, man. I just still want to test my microphone when streaming at the same time, like <laughs> it would sound awful. Got my lights. better okay a pair of frogs what do we do we complement them right like we did last time Oh my gosh, you got me. So Lauren, I have a question I tried to ask you last time when my microphone was off. So look, um, so you encounter these monsters, right? And every time when I... Um, when I spare their lives, I get some money, right? So it's just two golds, but still, I get something. And I believe that I will need money to buy uh, an armor later in this game. So my question is, uh, when I spare their lives, is there like a limited... Um, limited number of monsters I can um, I can encounter through the game or at certain levels because I read that when you play um, this uh, route when you when you kill everyone on the map so it's like they have a limited number of monsters to kill so after some time you will not encounter them at all. But if I show mercy to them and not kill them, are they infinite? Or these encounters also will end at, at, at some stage? Because I'm worrying about earning golds here. Like now I got four golds and... Uh, is it... Infinite that I can earn it this this way or oh my gosh once again okay thank you that was my question yeah thank you so that actually means if I spend oh my gosh if I spend like a lot of time I can earn a lot of money. That's good to know. Oh, okay. 
this thing happened what you told me like if you fall 10 times there will be no more holes look it actually happened wow Theoretically, yes, you can do that, but it would really be a little time-consuming. <clears throat> yeah, time-consuming, but at least I know that I can earn money, right? <clears throat> and I don't need to stream when I earn money. I can do it like an hour a day, and then I'll have enough money to buy the armor. Yeah, that's the easter egg. Thanks. Thanks for telling me that, though. This was faster. Oh, there. Partner, who said you could push me around, huh? So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm, you want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Hey, not there! Hmm, that was the wrong direction. Okay, think I got it. Thank you, Stone. What? Get back. Mm -hmm. You want me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. You're a stone. Move. I can confirm I see rock stock every day. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. This game is funny, eh? I really like this game, man. Every time, like, when I play, I admire. Whoever made this game is genius. Like, in their own way, of course. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Oh, finally, I got my life back. See you later, Lauren. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Okay, I'm not. Can I take it? Okay, can't do anything with that. Ghost! Sleeping. Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud, repeatedly pretending to sleep. <laughs> Move it with force now. Okay, let's try to move it. Here comes Napster Block. You gave Napster Block a patient smile. Here. Let's try to cheer you more. Really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. Cheering seems to have improved Napster looks good again. Let's cheer more. Napster Blue wants to show you something. Let me try. Ooh, I call it Dapper Blue. 
You like it? Of course I do. Of course I like it. Absolutely look eagerly awaits your response. Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's so... There's nobody around, but today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. Get out of your way. Yeah, that was a ghost guy, yeah. I don't remember what I did with him last time in my first run. But it's... Um, it's more satisfying not to kill anyone. Look, he got the passion. passion. I'll get out of your way. Thank you. Thank you, Napster Blook. What's in here? Some spider scrolled down and gave you a donut. Oh, I have a donut now. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. I don't think I have enough money. But what I can do... Maybe I can encounter some monsters to get four more golds. Pastries made of spiders. I think it's not made of spiders, it's I think it's made by spiders, no? At least I want to think so. Hey nobody's attacking me. Oh come on, please. Please. I want some monsters. Oh, finally. All right. Oh, zero gold. <laughs> My arachnophobia wouldn't even touch it, let alone get near it at all. Risk dance. Yeah, I'm doing that dance. <laughs> Uh, I also don't like spiders, but like some of them are not dangerous at all. Oh, they just have no money for me. Let's call Toriel. Dialing. This is Toriel, you only wanted to say hello? Well then, hello. I hope that su suffices. Hehe, <laughs> click. Okay. Hello, Toriel. Hello, Toriel. Okay, this is Toriel. You wanna know more about me? Well, I'm afraid there's not much to say. I'm just a silly little lady who worries too much. Oh... This is Toriel, huh? Did you just call me mom? Well, I suppose, would that make you happy? To call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Oh no. These monsters are poor, they don't have any money. Maybe I should go to another one. Oh my gosh! Okay. Oh, should I? Oh, whoa. Now I have to go all the way. Oh my god. 
silly little lady who worries too much. How does Undertale know the exact characteristics of my grandma? Do they know my name too? <laughs> Grandmas are great, man. I love my grandma. Almost. I think they're giving me molds. This, um, those molds. Wimps. Okay. Zero gold. I think they give zero golds for those who don't attack you. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, <laughs> almost. <laughs> Bruh. Okay, I'll get some money now. Two golds is two golds. When you reach the leaves, go down right up and they go right down, right up. There you go. Okay, let me try again. Oh my gosh! So I come here, I come here, I go here. Okay, so down, right, up, down. Too early to go to right? Zero gold. Okay, four, four gold. Four gold. Easy money. Down all the way. And the right all the way. Then up all the way. Okay. Ooh. You almost got me. Thanks, Lauren. I'll, I'll do it now. Okay, four gold. So I go like, oh, <laughs> yeah, nice. Thank you. Uh, okay. Small, small. So those who doesn't attack, you don't have money. I can buy something else from here. A jug. Spider donut and spider cider. Alright. Let me flirt with her. Dialy. Huh? Are you flirting with your mother? Oh, <laughs> how adorable. I couldn't... I could pinch your cheek. You can certainly find better than an old woman like me. That's true. Anyway, Toriel, I like you. Did you miss it? Spider bake sailed down and to the right. Come eat food made by spiders. Or spiders. Oh, spiders. Oh, shit. So you were right. That food made of spiders. Okay. Ribbit, ribbit, I heard using F4 can make you have a full screen. But what does F4 stands for? For frogs. 
I've only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling to say the least. Vegetoid came out of the earth. You fed your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Oh my gosh. Vegetal cake is softly. <laughs> okay. Vegetoid. Thank you, Vegetoid. I've heard you're quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think of that? Very helpful, thank you. It is rather helpful, remember. Sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day you'll have to do it even if their name isn't yellow. What? They want me to fight? I don't want to fight. Ring. Hello? I just realized that it has been a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up. But do not carry more than you need. Someday, someday you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room your pockets for that. Oh dear, are you serious? And after you said you want to call me mother? You're an interesting child. <laughs> yeah. Okay. This is Toriel. You want to say hello again? Salutations. Is that enough? Are you bored? I should have given a book to you. My apologies. Why not use your imagination to divert yourself? Pretend you are a monarch. Rule over the leaf pile with a fist of iron. Can you do that for me? This is Toriel. Hello, my child. Sorry, I do not have much to say. It was nice to hear your voice, though. I think that's... That's the most I can hear, hear from her. Yeah. No more conversations. It's just one switch. Oh shit. What is this? Oh! Vegeto, it came out of the earth. Okay, let's have a dinner. Eat your greens. No, 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 no. Okay, another four gold. Oh, okay, I remember. Looks Jew near. Who's looks? No, I'm not fighting you, sorry. Uh, don't be gone. Finally, someone gets it. Oh, no, 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 no. Five golds. Thank you. Okay, wrong. Wrong place. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm so bad at avoiding. Vegetoids. Hello, Vegetoids. I need some life. No, 
no, no, no, no, no, no. Oh, I'm alive. When my greens are leaving, they don't look so appetizing anymore. You must eat greens. You must eat. I personally think you can eat almost everything. Because eating is life for people, right? You must not overeat though, but greens, greens are nice. Okay, Napster look. Fell down a hole, now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. Cha cha cha. But what do you do? <laughs> it did dance. <laughs> it did dance. You're filled with the determination. Yeah, I need to visit Timmy's <laughs> determination. Yeah, I remember that. Okay, let me save this Vegetoid. Okay, let's eat a green. Oh my gosh! It hit me! Okay, now let's... Oh, there's another Vegetoid. What if I choose Peek On? Oh, I should... My God, I shouldn't have done that. Oh, I'm dying. I don't want to die. Mm. I don't want to die. Eat your greens or eat attacks. I better eat greens. <laughs> I don't know how, but I think I'm lucky to choose correct ones every time. Oh no, I hope I won't die. La la la, just be yourself. Are you dancing again? Oh, thank you, man. Thank you. I think when you play this game in, in, in uh, Pacific Run and don't hit anyone, this game's actually helping you. I feel that, at least. It's a switch, press it. Nothing happens. The bar door is not an exit, it simply marks a rotation in perspective. It's a switch, press it, yep. Nothing happens. It's a switch, press it. Nothing happens. Please don't kill me. Oh, thank you, man.
I mean, obviously you shouldn't be a genocidal maniac whether you play Undertale or not, but this kind of spreads the message. Yeah, correct. I think the same. I mean, they are not bad, right? I mean, they are good people. I mean, not people, monsters, but still, they are good people, right? They don't do anything bad. Why should I harm them? Yeah. But I like this message. Oh no! I mean the message of being merciful to people. Around us. Oh! Boom. What? It's a switch. Press it. Yep. You hear a clicking sound. Okay. If you can read this, press the blue switch. You see, this game is actually helps me. If you can read this, press the red switch. Okay. I just tried. It actually tells me to to press the red one. But I am curious. It's a switch, press it, yep. Okay. You hear a clicking sound. Oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> My god! They're gonna kill me. They are going to kill me. I am not staring at you, right? Ten golds! I'm gonna be rich! Shit! Oh no, all the way down to the left. Up. It's a switch, press it, yep. If you can read this, press the green switch. <laughs> okay, I was lucky it was green. This game is so simple, but it really has a good story. I mean, no graphics. Simple puzzles. But still a very nice game. Um, I'm not quite sure where to go first. Let me talk to you. Just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. Really? We are all too intimidated to talk to her. Oh! The Whoa! You found a toy knife? Uh, I don't think I need any weapons. Right? I don't need any weapons. I can sell them. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? 
There, there, I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Uh, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Every time this old tree grows and leaves, they fall right off. Uh, grows any leaves. tree. Seeing such a cute tidy house in the ruins give you determination. Okay, I am full life now. Do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. Oh, <laughs> so... Hi, Akira. How are you? So they say... So I chose butterscotch, but she made both butterscotch and cinnamon. Thank you, Toriel. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pile for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. These books are worn, they must have been read many times. I go after her or inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 2010s the ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer mm, it's a history book here's a random page trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks we retreated far far into the earth we walked until we reached the caverns caverns end this was our new home, which we named Home. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. <laughs> the fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could put your hand inside, I don't want to. Seems like the right size for Toriel. Empty table. I like how Toriel absolutely childproofed the entire house, even the fireplace. Oh, I didn't notice that! I mean, about these things, I mean, these tools, yeah, I noticed. But I didn't notice about the fire. Wow. So yeah, she did everything not to harm anyone. For some reason, there is a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. So I can't take it. There is some white fur stuck in the drain. White fur? Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. Oh, this is my cinnamon pie. What a nice smell, too hot to eat though. The stove top is very clean, Toriel must use fire magic instead. Maybe this is also a fire magic. Nah, that's not how fire works. Hey, Ascetic Gaming. What's up? Why does this guy look like Cassio a bit? Who? Who's Cassio and what guy? You mean this kid? In the game? Sorry, I don't know who Cassio is. Undertale peaking the laws of physics. Ah. Uh, you mean about fire, right? Maybe she's using a magic fire. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. This room from last time is something is something burning. Mm, make yourself at home. You have seen this type of plant before, but don't know its do not know its name. I so I, yeah, I don't remember the name of that plant, but I saw it somewhere last time. Yeah, I remember that. Inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Oh, so when you come from this side, the writings come at the bottom. 
and when you come from you approach from this side writings oh so the writings are going on top this is me it's you I like how they did this game man even mirrors like Ilya Dilaris. I don't know what you're talking about, people. I know, but magic fire hurts as show in the fight, but still, fire is fire and fire burns, otherwise it's just hot water. <laughs> yeah, but who knows about magic fires, right? You've seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name under renovations just a regular old bucket of snails it's a real diary read the circle passage you read the passage why did the skeleton want a friend because she was feeling lonely <laughs> nice the rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber Is pressing a wrong key. Ah, uh, the cactus. Truly the most sandy of plants. Definitely bigger than a twin size bed. It's an encyclopedia of subterran subterranean plants you open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods, known more commonly as other sausages. You pick inside scandalous historical sock drawer. You can't stop looking at the socks. Yeah, what happened with the socks? Tutorial surely can't be shooting brick cardboard fire out of nowhere. Why did I put brick and cardboard together? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But um, but can she use a magic at all? Look at these cool toys, they don't interest you at all. <laughs> so the toys are cool, but I'm not interested, alright. An empty photo frame, it's really dusty. What photo was on that frame though? A box of kids shoes and dis disparity of sizes. Those children who came before me, they all stayed in this room. How did kids die, though? Hey, Raziel. Raziel, do you speak Russian? If you do, then привет to you too. Oh. Okay, I can turn off the lights. Turn the light on first. Oh, a pie! You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Somebody dropped it on the on floor for you. And I know who. Is she here? No, she's not. Can I turn the... I cannot turn the light on, right?
о боже, это еще один русский, но ну, если ты это читаешь, то я сейчас мяукаю. Лорен? Are you Russian too? And go back to Toriel's house after you end Pacific's room. There is an easter egg in this. Yummy pie. And I'm speaking through a translator. Um, but I don't understand. I don't like your stream. Oh, what? <laughs> you got me confused, people. <laughs> Бросаю бары быстрее, чем вспышка. Давай, собака, ты же знаешь, что я деньги. Лорен, what the heck? Oh. How did you know that I'm Russian, though? Thank you, Akira. I'll go back after I finish. Почему вы читаете это? Why are you reading this? <laughs> <laughs> You're making fun of me, right? <laughs> я не понимаю, кто ты. <laughs> Потому что я могу грамотно объяснить. <laughs> oh, you're using translator. <laughs> okay. Should I go? Thank you, Akira. Thank you. Oh, oh she's here. Is here. Can I talk to her? Up already? I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? What? This... this is your home now. Would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It's called 70 uses for snails. How about it? How to exit the ruins? Mm, how about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails sometimes flip their digestive systems as they mature? Interesting. Yeah, it was interesting. Well, bother me if you need anything else. Прочти это, если тебя зовут Octopus Gaming. Okay. I am Octopus, ugly octopus. And I read what you... What you wrote, Lauren? Я их помню, как Undertale только вышел. Это были незабываемые воспоминания. Я так и не понял, кто ты, русский или американец. Резил, я да, сейчас в Новой Зеландии, но я из России, да. Резил, yes, I am, I am Russian. I mean, I am from Russia originally, but I am currently in New Zealand. Hey, Lauren. <laughs> You're mewing again. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Um, before talking to her about leaving the ruins, maybe I should go... I think you should play upstairs instead. Oh, she's taking me back. Um, can I get another sleep? If I have another shut eye, it's a short one. What will happen? No more pies. Okay, save some electricity. Go back for some funny flavor text. Go back where? her? Back to Toriel? Into Toriel's basement? Okay. Let's go back.
It is dangerous to play here. Um, so if I am being stubborn, it's drafty here. You will catch a cold. Oh, leave me, Toriel. It's dusty here. You'll catch a cough. <laughs> she is so protective, man. There's nothing to see here. Do you want to read a book? You do not like the game you're playing. Why not go for a walk in the yard? I wanna go to basement. Really now? She's too caring. Uh I think she she ran out of her words. She has nothing to say to me. She's like, uh go back. Uh, okay. Doesn't want to speak to me. I guess she understands that words don't affect me. What is it? How to exit the ruins? I have to do something. Stay here. Hey! Hey! She's in the ruins, right? You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Look, people, I have a question. So there were um, other kids before me, right? So they came here into ruins and uh, they they died. How did they die? Monsters killed them? Or they just died like a, of some natural causes? So that question bothers me. Because if monsters killed those kids, like seven kids before me, or six, I don't remember. So it means monsters are not so good to people, right? To humans. Toriel when you go into basement. Also Toriel when you go into basement. <laughs> yeah. So monsters killed them. Six chi six children. Oh my gosh. So they killed six children and now I'm doing a pacifist run. Uh, why do I do Pacific run then? I mean Toriel, okay, she's she's all right. I don't think she killed anyone. She tries to to um she tries to save them here, right? But every kid they try to leave the, the ruins. The ruins and then those monsters kill children every human that falls down here miss the same fate i have seen it again and again they come they leave they die you naive child if you leave the ruins they ascor will kill you so this is the 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 answer to my question Should I spare Asgore life as well? Damn, I remember Ezreal in Chara's story. Nope. I'm gonna cry. Um I don't I, I don't remember their stories. But 
Ah, oh, come on. How, how you kill children, man? I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. You want to leave so badly? Hmm. You're just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Oh my gosh, now I'm thinking. Now I'm thinking. Last time I killed Ascor. I don't know. Ascor has plot piercing only. Ah. Ah, Frisk got plots armor protect and blast resist. Got plot armor six blast resist. Escor has blood piercing to Akira, no spoiler. Um Um I don't know. I hope I will understand the, 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 the story of this game, but now it really makes me thinking. Cause the first time when I played I killed like a lot of monsters and I killed Toriel and I was sorry about to kill Toriel and I killed dogs I was also sorry about dogs but I and I also killed Escor but Escor kill Escor killed other children so I was kinda good I mean I was kinda okay with killing Escor last time but Escor is Toriel's husband right? Remember the frogget. Yeah, frogget said sometimes you need to fight even if you don't want to. He said maybe you might have to spare enemies if their enemies aren't yellow. Yeah, frogget told told that. Yeah, I know, I know, but come on. I don't know what to do with Ascor, sorry. Prove to me you're strong enough to survive. Wait, why are you looking at me like that? So last time I, I, I killed her, Toriel, because I wanted to spare her life, but it didn't work. Like you have seen a ghost. Do you know something that I do not? Toriel. Toriel, you're lucky you don't know what I did to you last time. But I'm happy you're alive. No, that's impossible. about telling Toriel that you saw her die, but that's creepy. Can you show mercy without fighting or running away? Toriel looks through you. Okay, I will try. I'm not hitting you this time. I'm not doing it. I am not doing it. I am not doing it, Toriel. Oh my gosh. Okay, now she's sparing my life actually. And what Frogget said comes in handy when sparing Tori. Yeah. I understand it now, but the first time I played, I didn't get it. 
mean, last time I tried to, to talk to her, try to do things, but it didn't work out, so I started to hit her. And I knew that she didn't want to hurt me. Fight me or leave. And when she said that, fight me or leave, I think I started to fight her. If I remember right. Stop it. Stop looking at me. You see, she's not leaving. She's not attacking me, doing nothing. I know you want to go home, but... But please, go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please go upstairs. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. Oh my gosh, Toriel. Toriel. Hey, Andrew. Yeah. Mercy, mercy. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small. Once you get used to them, it would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectation, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I'll put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, Please do not come back. I hope you understand. Oh, Toriel. My sweet Toriel. Bye, my child. Oh, this oh this pie I had one piece of it the size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it if you go to the beginning of the game goat mom is there watering flowers Okay. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Okay. I really wanted to watch this till the end, but I have to go to sleep because it's almost 3 a.m. in my country. So yeah, goodbye. Goodbye, Akira. Thank you for stopping by. Have a good night. Have a good rest. I think I'll be playing for another two hours. Lauren, you don't need to, really. I mean, if you need to go to... to go to sleep, then... you should go, Lauren. Goodbye, Akira. 
So what do you mean if I go to the beginning of the game? If you go to the beginning of the game, Gold Mom is there watering flowers. I want to see that. I want to see her watering flowers. Let me go there quickly. I really want to see it. I want to see if the ghost is there. Or gold. What is that swinging between their legs? Is it what I think? No, frogs don't have balls, right? Uh, looks! Zero money. Oh my gosh. But that's good. That's good that I fell down. It'll save me time. I guess. Gold's easy money. Okay, she was here, I remember. After I finish Undertale, I'm gonna play Undertale Yellow. But finishing Undertale will take hours for me. Oh, I sold it. Dummy. It's not working. Switches are done. Okay, I'm in the beginning. Oh, she's here! I'm not gonna step on flowers. Do not worry about me. Someone has to take care of these flowers. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna cry, man. She's so kind. She has such a big heart. I'm happy I could start the game over. Do not kill you. Can I call you from here? <laughs> I'm calling her. She's right next to me. I'm calling her. Nobody picked up. Oh! What do you mean? 
What do you mean nobody picked up? Hey, Toriel, I'm calling you. Golden flowers, they must have broken your fall. Oh, yeah, so when I fell through the hole, I fell on these flowers. Oh, sorry. I didn't want to I didn't want to step on them. Toriel. You know, I love you, Toriel. Goodbye. But if I'm going to I don't know, but if I'm going to Kill Ascor, your husband. I don't want to do it, but yeah. Bye, Toriel. Oh, man. Oh, man. Flowey is not here. That mad Flowey. Okay, let's go. Let's go. It was just on my one of my friends asking if um if everyone is all right from our families. Because we had this uh, terrorist attack in Moscow yesterday. But thanks to God, thanks to God, everyone I know is safe. I have some friends in Moscow, but I think they're safe. at what you've done. My son goes to Moscow today. They have a trip with their class. What is it between its legs? What is that thing moving? Looks like eyes. I don't know. Okay, I earned two golds. Two golds is okay. Uh, all right. All righty. Golds better than 
uh, zero. Uh, if I whoa, I did it! I did it! I did it. I want to save just in case. Vegetoids. Oh, okay. Moment of truth. And she said not to come back. Oh, wait, same place, no? Undertale. This is where the game starts. By Toby Fox. Toby, man. You're a genius, man. You're a real genius. Toby. Thank you, Toby, for this game. Thank you, man. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. Hey, somebody, somebody's watching me. It's a tough looking branch, it's too heavy to pick up. What was that sound? Oh, it broke. It's been smashed like it was nothing. Somebody broke it. Oh my gosh. Scary, scary. There was someone, I saw someone. Someone is following me. I think it's sense. sense yeah it was him human what are you showing to me oh it was your hand arm I mean Hey, the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. <laughs> Making fun of you, right? Wait a sec. Have you heard it before or something? 
<laughs> you turned around before I said to. Weird. Oh, okay. Another thing from um, from my older run. Whatever. You're human, right? I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but... You know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother Papyrus is a human hunting, hunting fanatic. Sans Thunderman. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through my bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind the conveniently shaped lamp. That shape is just the shape of my body. Sup, bro? You know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp is really cool. Do you wanna look? No, I don't have time for that. What if human comes through here? I wanna be ready. I'll be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things utterly deserved. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in shower of kisses every morning. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping you lazy bones. All you do is sit and bundoggle. What's that word? <laughs> you get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've got a ton of work done today. A skeleton! <laughs> Stand up. Okay, Sans. Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it. Uh, why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Whoa, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. <laughs> uh, I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, Put a little more backbone into it. Ah, <laughs> oh, jokers. Jokers, funny man. Hey. Okay, you can come out now. You gotta get going. He might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of hi my hilarious jokes. What's the holdup? Look, there's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a dark cavern filled with skeletons and horrible monsters. Well, you gotta get going. He might come back, and if he does... Yeah, but your, your jokes were fun. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard and relish sitting inside. Can I get a bottle? No, I cannot. Just a conveniently shaped lamp. Uh, I cannot hide it, hide behind it any, anymore. Let's go, let's go. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. Okay. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Okay. This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, the box lover.
no Drake flutters forth. Uh, what should I do? Should I choke? Can you make a bad ice pun? Is that supposed to be funny? Snow Drake is smiling at its own bad joke. Uh, should I laugh? You laugh at Snow Drake's before it says anything funny. What are you laughing at? Oh, it didn't work. Okay. You boo the Snow Drake. This won't be funny either. Whoa! It almost got me, man! Snow Drake realized its own name is a pun and is freaking out. You make a bad ice pun. It smells like a wet pillow. Should I make another joke? You make a ba bad ice pun. Is that supposed to be funny? Oh my gosh, it got me, man! Check. This teen comedian fights to keep a captive audience. Oh my god. Snow Drake is practicing its next part. I think I need to laugh. You laugh at Snow Drake's part. See? Laughs. That was wrong. Oh my. Oh shit! Sorry. Snow Drake is pleased with its cool joke. Okay, I just had to laugh at it. 12 golds! 12 golds, man! 12 golds! It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yes. All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. Hey, what if I want to call? You send the line back out. It's a fishing rod, okay. Uh, all right. So, as I was saying about Undine, I don't know how, I don't remember how to say her name, right? Whoa, 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 what's happening? Science. Oh my god, is that a human? It looks so familiar. <laughs> yeah, you look familiar to me too. Uh, I think it looks familiar. Because it's a rock. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god, Sans, I finally did it. What's her name? Undin Undine. Undin. I'll call her Undin. I don't know. Undin will. I'm gonna. I'll be so popular, popular, popular! Um, human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then... I am not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kids. I'll keep a nice socket out for you. <laughs> Eye sockets. <laughs> oh man. Keep an eye. Keep an eye socket. That was fun. Anyway, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ice cap ice cap struts into view. No, I'm not fighting you. Uh, you tried to steal Ice Cap's hat, but it's not weakened enough. 
I knew it, thief! Here comes that new cloth smell. You inform Icecap that it has a great hat. My hat's too loud for me to hear you. Oh! Whoa! Icecap also wants a hat for its nose. Whoa! You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? Ice Cap is secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. I'm ignoring you. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems defeated. Better hatter than a hater. Ice Cap is desperate for attention. I'm not touching you. Can I do it once again? You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hats. It seems defeated. Okay, I'll ignore you too. Let me try again. Let me try again. You continue not looking. It seems defeated. Better hatter than a hater. Whoa, that was close! Whoa, did you see that? That was close, man! Anyway, doesn't do anything, I guess. 13 golds! 13 golds! Hey, nobody picked up. Oh. My gosh, I did a mistake. Thanks God, I didn't kill it. Oh my gosh. Oh. oh shit. Holy shit! That doesn't count, right? I didn't kill it. I'm still pacifist, right? Right? I am still pacifist. And it gave me only 7 gold. Oh my god! I just slept it one time. There is some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. The virus, man. Oh my gosh. No, 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 I'm not fighting you. I'm not fighting you. Okay, 13 gold. Last time I hit it, I got only 7. But now I got 13. Absolutely no moving. A dog. Did something move? 
was it in my, my imagination I can only see moving things? If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Doggo blocks the way. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Not touching it. Not touching it. Not touching it. Not touching. Doggo can't seem to find anything. Can you sniff? Can you sniff that I'm... That I'm scared? What does it say? Whoa, 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 Okay. What? I've been pet! Pet! What? Pet, what? Oh, 30 golds. Something pet me, something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Who are you? Hello? Is anybody there? No? Are you two playing a trick on me? Real funny. I cannot move. Big guy? Is that you? Come on. Well, it's not the tall skeleton, he's too loud. Whoever you are, knock it off. Hey, doggy! Okay, it has nothing to say. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Why you burn it? Okay. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about Blue stop signs. Why are you right? Oh my gosh, and they use yellow yellow fonts for that? Oh, Toby, Toby Fox, you're a funny guy. Okay, remember blue stop signs. Remember blue stop signs. Okay. North. Ice, south. Ice, west, ice. Where do we go? East, Snowden Town. And ice. A snowman! Hello, I'm a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you'd be so kind, traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Thank you, good luck. You got the snowman piece. How am I doing? But uh, I mean the piece of me I gave you. Really though? That human! Do I know that person? Do you not know? Who you know? Of course I know who I know. I wanted to know if you know. I know who I know it. I want to know if you know I know who I know as much as I know I know who I know. You know? <laughs> oh, 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 speak of the devil. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a heart zap. Sound like fun? Because... The amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. What? <laughs> Sans, what did you do? 
I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. I don't want to touch it. Hold this, please. <laughs> okay, try now. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. I can use the, 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 the same walk which you used. Incredible, you slippery snail! You solved it so easily, too easily! However, the next puzzle will not be easy. Savok 2345, скажи что-нибудь на русском. Привет! Next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. You'll be surely, you will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his. Battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Yeah, he is. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. Oh, okay, you saying same things. Alright. Let's go, let's go. <clears throat> I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, the customer. Would you like some ice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 G. No, sorry. Well then, tell your friends there's ice cream out in the middle of the woods. Okay, I'll tell my friends. I remember this game. Oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> I'm so bad. I am so bad. Oh no. It's getting smaller. Got it! So what? Purple, even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of ball. You were awarded 2G. Okay, I got two golds. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow di dicahedron. What is snow dicahedron? What does it mean? Oh no, 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 no. I think it's too early to come there. Oh, Sans! I've been thinking about selling trees too. Want some fried snow? It's just 5G. No, I don't want. You're right. I should charge way more than that. No, sorry, I don't want it. His... Hers. It is those two doggos that I killed last time. Smell danger rating. Snow smell snowman. White rating can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans. Green rating. Destroyed at all costs. That wasn't green at all. Okay, we should go. I don't have anything else here. How much money do I have? Well, 
165. Not much. Human, I hope you're ready for... Sans, where's the puzzle? Sorry, I got a message. Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can they can get past this one. Sans, they didn't even look at it. Whoops! I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That's easy PC war scramble. That's for baby bones. Uh. Believable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder, jumble or crossword? Mm, I think crossword is harder. You two are weird. Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. I just fill all the boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Yeah. <laughs> Papyrus, nice difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday, he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Horoscope, yeah. It's strange. Fall, monsters, cigars, winter, skeleton, sick, spring, mermaid, glass, for summer, robot, hot. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Wait, well, last time when I played this game, it had different... Dif different words, I guess. But I already sold it last time, so we can go on. We go on. What is this? It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. Little do you know, this spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly shaped again by the great Papyrus. <laughs> papyrus. Okay. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It is so cold. It's stuck to the table. Can I heat it? Heat it up? It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. Hey mouse! I hear you mouse! Warning! Dog marriage! Lesser dog appears. Oh, there's so many pets. Which one to choose? I'll choose this. You barely lifted your hand and lesser dog got excited. Bent, bent. Okay. Whoa. It is a map. It is a map. It is a map. It's it tries to tell me something. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. Okay, I think I opened it up. Ice cap appears, Jerry came too. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. I just lower my head, okay?
I don't know what happened, but that monster, he just disappeared. The other small to celebrate Jerry's disappearance. They don't like each other, I guess. Okay, I ignore you. I know what to do. I need to ignore you. You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. What? What you're doing? Oh no! Ice Cap is secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. No, I'm, 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 I'm ignoring you. And I'm ignoring, I'm not looking at you. Seems defeated. Better hater than hater, Kasa! Return of Jerry. Ah, did they ditch me? Some friends. Return of Jerry. So like, what are you even doing? You and uh, the other monsters. <laughs> okay, Jerry. Okay. Okay, let's let's continue. Let us let us continue our journey. Oh, those two doggies. Uh, no. Not those two yet. What's the smell? Where's that smell? Your smell? Identify your smell. Hmm. Is that weird smell? It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Doggy assault you. Last time I... I think last time I, I, I killed these doggies. What's that smell? Shit! You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Let's get human tail. Do humans have tails? The dogs may want to resmell you. Dogs sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you smell all right. What smells like a? Are you actually a little puppy? Oh my! I'm dead. Hey, Tommy, how you doing? Oh, I died. He stay determined. I died. This is my first death in the game. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. How are things going, Tommy? As you can see, I'm back online. Oh my gosh. I didn't hit the switch. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. Okay, I click the switch. Pet him 100 times. 100 times? No, one was enough. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If I pet him 100 times, something happens or what? Oh my gosh! I made a mistake. It's 
Smells like a puppy. My god! What do you want me to do? Oh, oh shit! Oh my god! God, I'm dying again. I am dying again. Whoa, bit by another pup? Well, don't leave me out. I'm dying. I'm dying. <laughs> okay, I'll try to pit them. Oh my... No, 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 no. Sorry. Sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. Shit. Shit. I need my health back. You stick if you want to skip every dog. A stick? What do you mean a stick? What stick? What are you doing? Shit! I need to concentrate. No! Okay. Ah. 
Oh! I'm sorry. I am sorry. That was just... Oh. That was an accident, alright? That was an accident. What? Whoa! Oh, you say it was a little bad luck, but I guess I had a good, good luck now. Oh, finally, finally. I need some life. You think I should pet them too? Instead of like smelling like a doggo? Uh, okay. Oh. Hey. Oh no. Oh. Oh. I'm almost done. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting better. Thanks, Tommy. Uh. Well, pit by another pup. Well, don't leave me out. Whoa. Whoa. Don't think that you may be lost, puppy. Bit by another pup. Oh, oh, oh my gosh! Oh, I was so lucky, man. Oh, no, 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 no. What about me? A dog that pets dogs amazing. Ooh. Oh, I won. I won. 40 golds. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Wow.
need to get my health back. Yes, Tommy, I won. Thank you. <laughs> To be honest, I watched on YouTube how to um, how to escape those. Um, how do you call this? Those axes that fall up on you. So I googled it how to escape those. So because I didn't know how how to do that, but that helped me a lot. Turn every X into zero and then press the switch. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Okay, I ate it. Really? Wowie! No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, Fred, not human, I... Master Chef Papyrus. We'll make you all the pasta you could ever want. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening! Oh, sock collection. Sock collection. Toriel had socks in her drawer. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Not cook pancakes. <laughs> yeah, I love pancakes. I I can actually cook pancakes. Not as good as my mother does, but still edible. Human. Mm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I'm saying is... Worry not, human. I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum, then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I try not to give away the answer. Turn every X into zero, then press the button. Okay. I solved it last time, I don't remember. How oh, I did that, but... Okay. Let's reset. Let's try again. Opens. Really, yay, I'll have a lot of friends' pancakes. <laughs> I really do cake. I, I, I do really cook pancakes, brother. Здорово, Sansik. Wow, you solved it. And you did it 
all without my help. Incredible, I am impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Да, Сансик, я с России, но сейчас я не в России. Ну да, я из России, это правда. Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help, which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Сансик, ты как тоже Undertale любишь? У тебя просто имя такое. Ну, я просто стримлю на английском. Вот, развиваю свой, скажем так, английский язык. Hey, it's that human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles all around are alarm tiles. If you step on them... If you step on them, you will have to fight the monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? That was so confusing. Hey, Tommy. Did you try... Um, did, did, did you try the... Um, how you call that? The Undertale yellow game yet? Did you see that one? Sansa, ты сам откуда? Только не говори, что из руин Undertale. Understand the explanation? Uh, of course. Great. Then there is one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull the switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Hey, Tommy, you must check it out. Like, people like it. I'll, I'll, I'll play that game. As I said last time, I will play Undertale Yellow, but it looks a bit complicated to me. That has never been seen before. Not even I, w I will know the solution. Get ready. <laughs> oh, this Toby Fox guy. He's so funny, man. He's so fucking funny. The machine isn't working. It's broken. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier, it wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. Oh, the floor inside is a box of pom pomeranians. Hmm. Aware of dog, please pet dog. This dog is starting, is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. Let me try to help you. I can't do anything with the snow, right? Ah, uh, okay. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. Ay, ay, ay. 
had to save. That doll considers itself an artist, but doesn't even know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of a kibble. Poor doggy. Uh, okay. This is an another puzzle. Oh! It's a snow papyrus. It's a snow papyrus, okay. It's a lump of snow with the word science written on it in red marker. <clears throat> okay, so this would be the last one. Let's do it. Done. Still, still going. <laughs> Can I go back? <laughs> I has a snow hat on my head. It's a snow puff. This is a snow puff. This is, however, a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff? Is it really snow puff? Behold, a snow puff! Uh, there's a 30G inside this. What is this? It's a snow puff. Uh, oh, oh, oh. A doggy? A doggy? Woof, woof. Oh, it's a big dog. <clears throat> it's the greater dog. Last time he said to pet the dog. You call the greater dog, it bounces towards you, flecking slobber into your face. Oh, I was lucky! Oh shit! I was lucky! <laughs> oh no, 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 no. I'm dead. We can do it again. Oh, don't, 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 no, shit. I wonder if I go and save. Stance is there. Will I get my 30G? Once again. Woof. What's a tiny doghouse? 30G, give me my Ah okay. It's not there anymore. <clears throat> Let us try it again. Mm. 
Let's pet it. Oh, okay. Oh no, man, no, no. Let's see what happens. I'm still alive. I'm still alive, man. Okay. Oh, shit. 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 <laughs> oh, okay. Anyway, anyway. Play. Okay, I'll try to. Oh, my gosh. You see, I play my own games. Play puzzles. I wanna try to get it closer first and then maybe I can pet it. Great dog. Oy, ay, ay, ay. What? Oh, look, I won. I won. Just didn't want to play with me. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I didn't do anything wrong, right? One more way to spare him. So I didn't do wrong, right? Hey, dust sands. I think you're the the, the third one who has. Sons in their names. <laughs> Thank you, Tommy. 
But that was interesting. Like, ignore it. And then it just got bored. And left. Uh, maybe I should talk to Sans first. Oh, he's gone! Sans is gone! He was here! Oh no, I wanted to talk to him. Who are you? If Trot confronts you. You remove a stocking filled with chicken nuggets. That's a little better. Whoa! 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 You remove a small, confused dog. That's a little better. Oh no, 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 no! Lenticular bookmark of a smug teen winking. The weight has been lifted. Oh, you almost killed me! I see a small house there! There's a small house! What is it? Oh, I remember, I remember. I remember I should have done something. That door. Um, I remember it now. There was something with that door. Human, this is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. A dog? When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, plates will slice, each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because... I am about to do it! <laughs> well, what's the holder? Holder? What holder? I'm, I'm about to activate it now! That, um, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah. We can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair and my traps are expert, expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. <laughs> Can I have that dog? Bro, if I could take it for you, <laughs> I would give it to you, man. That dog. Small dog. A puppy. You! What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. <laughs> I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Yeah, I understand blue attacks. Um, Tommy, do you remember how open that, um, that door?
Oh my gosh, he got me. I should have go left. Why if I hear sex? Awkward. Uh, did they ditch me? Okay, I'm gonna ditch you. You didn't know that door? Really? Must be a way to open it. Oh, sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. I didn't mean to. Okay, I'm gonna die now. I didn't die! What? So there must be a way to open that door. It's a door. Okay, I see. I see it's a door. Must be a way to open it. I just don't know how. And Sans was here. And I missed him. Maybe he would tell me what to do. Those guys looking at me. You're still on the ruins with Toriel? Oh. So you finished the game and came back to her, right? If I remember correct. Gosh! <laughs> okay, I fell down. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't harm Toriel this time. He's alive. Oh no 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 I'm sorry again oh shit oh, I'm attacking
Oh my gosh! What? Oh! <laughs> He laughs. That was wrong. Oh my! No! 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 Please! 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 Leave! Leave! <laughs> Oof! Peach. Oh! Did I make some money at least? I have three, three twenty-six, hundred twenty-six gold. Welcome to Snowden Town. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? No, I don't want anything. Huh? Sell something? Does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. <clears throat> I don't think I need any fools right now. I'm okay. Say hello. Hi, uh, welcome to the Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where'd you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? You wanna know what to do here in Snowden? Rilby's has food and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just snowed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost or can borrow... burrow under the door, forget about it. Life is the same as usual, a little claustrophobic. But we all know deep down the freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Okay. Bye now, I'll come again soon. Okay. I don't remember what I do in in. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? Welcome to the Snowden. Snowden's premier hotel. Well, feel free to come back anytime. Okay, it is closed. Don't want to walk to the other side of town? Try the under snow tunnels. They efficiently laid out. That lady over there, something about her disturbs me. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun, buns are so adorable, tee hee! Awful teens tormented the local monster by decorating its tree-like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. Yeah, help that deer.
Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Oh, you are wearing a striped shirt too. I wonder if that weird skeleton is an adult or a kid. I mean, sense. I think he's not a kid, but he's, he's like just a small skeleton. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's over ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. Politics. Okay. Everyone's here now. Oh, last time when I came here, I killed two dogs. Oh, now they sit and play together. I'm happy for you, dogs. I'm happy for you. Drunk. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, same people. Help, I want new drinks and... And hot guys. Are you flowy? Mm, isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm, I don't want to see the erasure of local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip into their butts. The jukebox is broken. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. <laughs> yeah, that big guy. Yeah. I'm thinking of getting a spike collar to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. Dogs are dogs, man. Oh, it's not saying anything. And this is another dog. I, I, be I believe this dog was looking at the snow. Trying to... Sculpt it in some way. Anyway, it's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. <laughs> losing and winning at the same time. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there is a plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. Oh, you look like a duck. Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undine. She's rude, loud and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. Okay, Grillbiz said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. Okay. I didn't look at this table. This table has nothing. Can I sit? I cannot sit either. Everyone's always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morals about it? Let's play monsters and humans. Okay, let's play. Uh, to be young again, the world sure felt boundless. You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? No, we're not playing that game, no worse. Uh, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patience, it was me. Ah. Uh, Oh, okay. That guy. <laughs> In 
interesting. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. I didn't notice. Library B. Okay. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Kaka, when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. That look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? Love, hope, compassion, this is what people say monster souls are made of. But that absolutely nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. Monster History Part 4 Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out of our world city home. We braved harsh cold, damp swampland and searing heat until we reached what we know what we now call our capital, New Home. Again, our king is really bad at names. Because they're made of magic, monsters' bodies are, are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill, mm, let's end the chapter here. Here I am, writing this book. The person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry, I'm still writing that one. While monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us. But they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet, bullet pattern birthday card. Why? It's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in, live on in that thing. Ah, uh, I'm at the page minimum yet. I'm kind of sick of writing this. out of the window. Okay, I cannot open the door. <laughs> it's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labeled papyrus. Look inside. Yep, it's empty. It's locked. It's locked from the inside. Okay. Human. Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Somehow I feel like you're an old friend. Yeah, we were friends last time. Even though I've never actually met you before. I just don't remember. I can't explain why I feel this way. Did I meet you online? Uh. We met like a month ago. I have many social media connections. It's hard to keep track of them all. Just a dozen more and uh, I'll finally reach double digits. <laughs> hey, wait a second. You can't be my friend. You're human. I can't believe you almost tricked me into not defeating you. Oopsie doopsie. Fire scene coming. Fire blocks the way. I don't remember what I did with him last time. I didn't kill him. That, that I remember. I will flirt with him. What? Flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings? Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards.
Oh no, you're meeting all my standards. I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date later, after I capture you. Pyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Oh no! Let's date later, after I capture you. Oh, isn't it too easy? Pyrus is thinking about what to cook for his date. You flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting won't es escalate this battle. Let's date later. Okay. Pyrus dabs some bone clone behind his ear. Do you have a e ear? Oh, he got eyes. You flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting won't escalate this battle. Dabs Marinara sauce behind his ear. So you won't fight? Then let's see if you can handle my feble blue attack. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> Fire is too busy fighting to flirt back. Fire steps MTT brand enemy power behind his ear. Well, I'm not thinking about that date thing. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Whoa! Dab's MTT brand attraction slime behind his ear. I can almost taste my future popularity. Oh no 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 I'm gonna die I'm gonna die Oh shit too weak, I was easily able to capture you. I will now send you to the capture zone, or as Sans calls it, our garage. You're in the doghouse now. <laughs> what? It's a squeaky chew toy. It's too small to sleep on. Unfortunately, it's just dry food. Did I do something wrong? Oh. I don't even have a mouse. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so bad with, with uh, making bars. It's a note from Papyrus. Sorry, I have to lock you in the guest room until Undine. I don't remember her name. Undine, Undine, Undine arrives. Anyway, feel free to make yourself at home. Refreshments and accommodations have been provided. Neophily yours, Papyrus. Okay. Okay, let me save and try to fight Papyrus again.
I'm gonna fight you again. I suppose this proves what I said. We really are bound together. Two bones in the skeletal anatomy of fate. That's how you appear here now. Even though it's very impossible for you to escape. Amazing. I feel a sincere... Wait a second. I still have to capture you. Whoopsie doopsie. Oh my gosh! Hey, what do I do? How do I... How do I... Pass Papyrus? Shit! Oh my gosh! I'm gonna die, man! I'll have lots of admirers, but... What? Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? What? My God! Oh, I'm gonna die. To stay alive, I'm trying to. <laughs> I'm trying to not to die. Someone like you is really rare. What? Virus is considering his options. Dating might be kind of hard. Oh, I should, I shouldn't move. Well, you may have clearly, cleverly escaped from jail before, but this time I've upgraded the facilities. Not only will you be trapped, but you won't even want to leave. <laughs> what? When you went. What? Bone shells of papyrus. What what did you say? It's an old from papyrus. Please ask before you escape. When you went in when missing, I got worried sick. Slightly bone shells of papyrus. We'll do it again, I think. 
How is my life, by the way? Okay. Oh, he worry about us. Yeah, he does, but back again, eh? I suppose it's my fault. I told you before that I would make you spaghetti. It's only natural that you would want to see me. In the dire hope that I would make you some. Well, I understand. Papyrus is hungry too. Hungry for justice. Maybe I should kick his ass. And then... Mercy his life. Whoa. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna die, man. I'm gonna die. Oh. Oh no! Oh shit! <laughs> Not as persistentest as Papyrus. The persistentest test. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Oh, It's a note from Papyrus. If you're just looking for a place to stay, just ask. You don't need to fight me. Your host, Papyrus. I don't know, maybe I should kick his ass. And then... What do I do? What do I do, man? What do I do? Oh, you're back again. I finally realized the true reason why you just miss seeing my face so much. I'm not sure I can fight someone who feels that way, but mostly I'm getting really tired of you capturing you. Okay, I guess. If you want me to capture you, I'll try again. <laughs> okay, let's try. Let's try. Let's do it again. Whoa! Whoa! Just say no. I said yes. 
<laughs> I said yes. Oh no. Let's see what what happens. Oh shit! Oh, no, 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 no. are persistent but I just it just won't work on me I am the persistentest and if you think you're pers persistentest that is wrong grammatically wrong because the correct form would be not as persistentest as papyrus the persistentest -est. oh say no this time I will say no this time yeah I hope you enjoyed this lesson because I'm not too good in this game to 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 leave enough if you just okay, I will say no this time. I don't remember how how I did pass this guy last time. You're back again. I finally realized her true reason why. You just miss seeing my face so much. I'm not sure I can't fight someone who feels this way, but mostly I'm getting really tired of capturing you. What do you think if I... If I, let's say... Hit him a lot. And then... Um, weaken him. And then he will just surrender because he was too weak. I want to try that. But anyway, no. Okay, I'm not going to fight you. Okay, I guess I'll accept my failure. Yeah, ho ho. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Anda is going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend quantity will remain stagnant. <laughs> no, 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 let's be friends. Really? You wanna be friends with me? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowie, we haven't even had our first date, and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant your permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern, then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit, except someone with a powerful soul like you. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is 
Well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that day. <laughs> okay, I'm coming. I'm coming back. I'll have a date with you. Please don't enter my mysterious snack shack. Wow, you're so eager to date me. You're trying to go into my house without me. That's really weird. I don't know what to do. Let's Okay, let's have a date. So you came back to have a date with me? You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Okay, we were going. Not library. Where are you taking me? Haha, oh, my house. Same people here. Okay, nothing changed. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a quiche, but filled with a sugary non-egg substance. How absurd. That's a trash can. Feel free to visit it anytime. Aha, interested in my food museum, please. Could you use my culinary art show? Half of the fridge is filled with containers, all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. Oh, a dog. What? Catch that middling... Can I? Oh, curses. <laughs> Stance, stop lagging my life with incidental music. Forget it. Okay, nothing else to do there. It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your socks. Okay. Don't put it back down, move it. Okay. You moved it two inches, move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. <laughs> you touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20G. It's a saggy old couch. Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says, stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Yep. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. <laughs> yeah, recursive. Welcome to Cynic My House. Enjoy and take your time. That's my room. 
If you finish looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. No, not yet. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. What is important? The door is locked. Okay, let's get in. Hey, those are the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it basically just happened. The internet, I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double digit follower count. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. That must be sans. The computer's internet browser is open to a social media site. There are no skeletons inside my closet, except me sometimes. Look in the closet? Yep, yeah, let's look. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. That book's one of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. <laughs> It's okay to be intimidated by fashion sense. Isn't that flag neat, Tom? And I found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> Ah, oh, yes, action figures. A great preference for all theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Is it Santa? Santa! That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway, wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream, so instead I cruise while I snooze. So, um, um if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Okay, let's begin. Okay, dating start. Here we are on our date. I've actually never done this before, but don't worry, you can spell prepared without several letters from my name. Yeah. I snagged an official dating rulebook from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step 1. Press the C key on your keyboard for dating heart. Okay. Wowie, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step 2. There's a sun. <laughs> a red eye for dogs, crime, meter, egg, population, fill it in. Never tell papyrus the truth about human and bones. <laughs> uh, he's actually human too. Maybe old human. Too old. Step 2. Ask them on a date. Um. Human, I, the Great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes? Really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part 3! Step 3. Put on nice clothes you, to show you care. Uh, wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandage hanging off of you. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be you wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yes. Yes, I want it. No, you planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. No, you're dating power. Date power. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't think you've bested me yet. Attention. I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating. 
and I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold. Yeah. What do you think of my secret style? Cool dude. I love it. No, a genie and compliments. Date power. <laughs> my date power goes up. However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and... Perseverance. Human souls are stronger than monster souls. But the souls of our shoes, on the other hand, mm, are about the same. There's no secret. Okay. Holding my hand, so I'll tell you the answer. No, I must resist. Let's check your pants. There's no secret to my legs. Oh, <laughs> still legs, okay. Okay, what about elbows? I see, I see. You like care caressing my biceps with a floating heart. <laughs> but who doesn't? Shoulders? Okay. My hat. My hat. My hat. Yeah. Okay. Well, then you found my secret. I suppose you have no choice. Is it? Is it brain? Looks like a. Looks like a present box. It's a present. A present just for you. Open it! Do you know what this is? No idea. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Is it spaghetti? You have no idea. Though this appears to be spaghetti. Fuck! <laughs> this ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti. Finally aged in oak and cask. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to get this. There's no way this can go any further. Okay, let me... Shit, I don't wanna eat it. Refuse. You, me, you're letting me have it instead because you know how much I love pasta. Impossible. Taking my present and turning it around on me. Oh, date power. Oh, no. I won. I know how to date skeletons. Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I am... Boy, it's hot in here. Or is it just me? Oh, shoot, human. You don't sweat, man. Human, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend. And act like this all never happened. After all, you're very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you, because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that, that's not true, but I'll help you settle for the second best. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, 
Here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically, well, gotta go. Can I sleep in your bed? Okay. Okay. So what do we do? Let me save just in case. Snowden, how of the virus? That's the slogan, right? Hey, where's the kid? is not there let's just keep going okay Tommy let's keep going I have another 30 minutes to play and then I need to go Lauren told me today that if I need to do, um, uh, if I want to do the true pacifist run, there must be some um, actions that I should do to get it. Otherwise, it will, as I understood, otherwise it will be just a pacifist run, not the true pacifist, which was different. Sound of rushing water fills you with determination. All that gives my life validation is explaining the echo flower. No one can know. Never trust a flower that's one of the constants of the world. Waterfall checkpoint. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome, she's the coolest, right? I wanna be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. What? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs mean twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to grill this. Wanna come? Yeah. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here, I know a shortcut. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hi, Sansi. Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? All you need is be kind with every monster for the best ending. I'm trying to, man. Eh? Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Here, get comfy. Oops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. It was you, Sans, right? <laughs> anyway, let's order. What do you want? Let's take fries. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Will be. We'll have a double order of fries. His head is on fire. I wonder if he cooks up on his head. So what do you think? Oh my brother. 
cool. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. You'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. <laughs> Price! Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Ah, uh, yes. Bon appetit. <laughs> he said bon appetit. <laughs> You would see the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bowl pours into your food. Whoops! Eh, forget about it. You can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries real hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of a royal guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the royal guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. <laughs> but the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's um, still a work in progress. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Yeah, ask me. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Uh, should I tell him the truth? Yes, I did. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Oh, that flowy thing. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. <laughs> oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? It's just... 10,000. No, I can't. Just kidding. Real big. Put it on my tab. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. Hey, tell me. Sans, where are you going? Ah, shit, he left. Okay, now it's open. Let us continue. Talk to you again. Let's hang out again sometime. Okay, what about you, kid? You! Are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome! Okay, I already talked to you last time. This is a box. You can put an item in it or take an item out. Would you though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. There is a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? Take it. You got the old tutu. Yeah. Or I saw something behind that rushing border. Ah, uh, yeah. I already got it.
I wonder how to open that door. Oh, she's here. Hi. Undine. I'm here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Mm, did I fight them? Yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Uh, well, no. I tried very hard, Undine, but in the end, I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But Undine, you don't have to destroy them. You see? You see? I understand. I'll help you in a, any way I can. Scary, scary bitch. Hey, I like to chill. How you doing? Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. What do you do to get her attention, huh? Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Oh. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. It's good to hear you're okay. I like to, to chill. Interesting nickname, by the way. I like to chill. People 9. Feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. When four bridge seas align in the water, they will sprout. Ah, uh, I know. It's it was easy. I remember. It was easy puzzle. Okay, the bridge is done. Air and plexus in. You tell Aaron to go away. Whoa, Spunky, love it! Smells like an underwater barnyard. You flex, Aaron flexes twice as hard. What? Oh. Lexus house. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. So, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a cross bandage. Is that true? Are you wearing a cross bandage? What will you say? Hmm. What would I say? Yes, I do. So you're wearing a cross bandage. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day.
If an error is made, the bell blossom can call bridge seeds back to where they started. Okay. I want to read that sign. What does it say? And one last sprout. Well, how do you call this thing? Congratulations, you failed the puzzle. <laughs> No, 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 oh my god, I need to redo it. time ago monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky if you hoped with all your heart your wish would come true now all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling yeah wishing room yeah no stars anymore wash us shuffles up You ask Washu to clean you, it hopes around excitedly. Green means clean. Oh shit! Poof. Okay, that was easy. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Come on, sis, make a wish. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. Look through the telescope, yes. Check wall. Check wall, okay. I'll check the wall. Uh, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. The stars don't change. Okay, which wall? Oh, you mean that? Okay. Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words. The war of humans and monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body even after death. If a monster defeats a human, they can take his soul, a monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with un... what? Unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Okay. I have 400. Can can I can I call Toriel? She is not answering. Ring ring. There's 
no response. Okay. Nobody wants to talk to me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Moving platform. Oh shit! <laughs> okay, I'm not losing my hope. At least I'm at full health now. Run, run, run! Shit! Oh, shit! Oh, managed to stay alive. <laughs> oh, you got it by its eye. Yo, did you see that? Undine just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky if you were standing just a little bit to the left? Yo, don't worry. I'm sure you'll s we'll see her again. Oh. Kid, just learn how to run. Monster Kid saved you one time. Yeah, it did. Oh, who are you? Who are you? Have you ever thought about a world where everything is exactly the same? Except you don't exist? Everything functions perfectly without you. Uh huh? The thought terrifies me. Who are you? The virus, please answer. There are many ancient blacks here. Waterfall is a practically a history museum. Except with muscular seahorses. Hi. What? Is it... Is it all? Nobody picked up. Okay. Three gold for the fur, no. Later then. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical bristle fills you with determination. It's quick. <laughs> of course it's quick. 
This cheese has been here so long a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Use the box. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 550 kg. Do you use this premium telescope? But since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Use the telescope. Yes, let me use it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I remember now, the black eye, the choker, <laughs> you are a choker, huh, you aren't satisfied, don't worry, I'll give you a full refund. <laughs> oh man. The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. It's a box for storing punch cards, it's empty right now. I relocated my store but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Ace the frozen treat. No, just no. No, 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 no. I don't want it. I don't want it. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally... There's nothing in it, right? <laughs> Just a black eye. <laughs> Man. You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? You're passing, okay. Mm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. I don't want to fight you. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Take it. Got the ballet shoes. Uh, I think it's time to upgrade. Ah, uh, no, I don't need it. It was a weapon. What I need is armor. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very murdery. But I bet you knew that already, and because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. A cross bandage. Because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. You're such a smart cookie. This way you're safe, and I didn't lie. No betrayal every, anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. I don't know what to say.
Whoa. Whoa. Do I need to collect those greens? I mean, if I... If I collect the green, what does it... What does it do? Don't say that, come on, I promise I won't laugh. The power to take their souls, this is the power that humans fear. Wait. There's no other place I can go to? What, I can't go in there? Okay, there's only one way I see. Let's do it. Let's do it. What are you? Who the hell are you, man? Hey, there, noticed you were here. I'm Onion Sun. Onion Sun, you here? You're visiting waterfall, uh huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too, it's my big favorite. Even though the water is getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time, but hey, that's okay, it is moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. And the aquarium's full. Anyway, so even if I wanted to, I. That's okay though, you hear? Andin's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Hey, there, that's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In waterfall. Hey, Tommy. Welcome back. I wonder how to open that door. I need to finish my stream. Shirin hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. Who are you, Shiren? You hum a jazz ballad, Shiren follows your melody. Oh, she's like Siren, okay. Shit! Oh, I, you know what, I always choose like, correct option, northern room hides a great treasure, okay, oh I remember this one, a haunting song echoes down the corridor, once you play along only the first eight are, okay. I sneezed. <laughs> this power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. An incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monsters called the boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death. If only for a few moments, a human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened, and now it never will. It's a statue, the structures at its feet seem dry.
Please take one. Take an umbrella, take one, okay. Put the umbrella on the statue, yes. You place the umbrella atop the statue. Inside the statue, a music box begins to play. Okay, let's try it. There's a piano here. Play it? Yes. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Of course I'll take it. You're carrying too many dogs. What do you mean? Annoying dog. You deployed the dog. Dog has lost the artifact. Hey! Okay. Um 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 Don't take it. No, you can eat dog salad. Why shouldn't should shouldn't I have um have I I mean why shouldn't I have taken the 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 artifact? It's a good thing though, I think. Yo, you got an umbrella! Awesome! Let's go! What if I didn't get an umbrella? An e-dog salad. Yeah, I know. It says it will recover some HP. 
Man, Andin is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night, knowing she was gonna beat me up. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undine came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. <laughs> you kid, you don't like studying, eh? Mm, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Yeah, she already attacked me. Why you stopped, by the way? Shit, what do I do? Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Hmm. E you wanna see Undine, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. What if I wanna keep my umbrella? Yo, you aren't going to be able to climb with umbrella. Ah. Uh -huh. So you don't just drop it on the floor, you return it. <laughs> Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me, I always find a way to get through. Oh, whoa. Falling. The kid is falling again. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. The serene sound of a distant music box, it fills you with determination. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and thus monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken and countless monsters were turned to dust. I think it's enough for today, man. Uh, I already played four hours now. Yeah, Monster Kid helped me two times, yeah. He's a good boy. Or girl. I don't know about monsters too much. But he's a kid. Um, Tommy. I really need to finish now. Already almost, let's say 20, 20 to 10 p.m. I need to prepare to sleep. Maybe have a late dinner. Anyway, thank you, Tommy, for coming by. I think I can play my like, next next time. I'm kind of free next week. Maybe. Maybe Tuesday. I don't know. Thank you, Tommy. You have a good evening, day, whatever time it is. Right now at your place. Thank you for helping me out again. Hopefully I'll see you next time, Tommy.